looks like Morgan was just leaving and we're going to have her experiment a little bit. Maybe she'll find out some new potions and then we're going to have her practice her magic. We'll see if she comes up with anything good. Hopefully she will because we need to hurry up and advance in her spell work. And let's see if the garden is up. Oh, nope. But this plant right here does need to be weeded. So we'll have her go ahead and do that when she's done. Come on, girl. Let's see if you can find something. Hopefully you'll find something good because we need to get this going here. We spent a lot of time at the magic realm. You found some tomes, but you can't really use them. Did you already weed that? Awesome. So we're going to have her go ahead and practice a little bit of her spell work. So let's have her practice some magic. Come back over here, girl. Okay, so... And we're going to have her go ahead and practice some magic. We're going to do mischief magic because we like a little mischief. She still wants to cloud gaze with Simon. Why do you keep going in the house? What's in there? Oh, you're doing it in there? You can just sit there and practice some magic in the middle of the hallway, huh? Okay, well, we have Marcus's grave. So I think we're going to go ahead and take a little trip to the graveyard. She can go put it in there. And I think we're going to invite over her new friend and see what he's all about. We know a little bit about him. Oh, wait, we know everything about him. Oh, we do. Okay, awesome. So he's a geek, he's ambitious, and he's good. Well, that's really good. I think that he is definitely someone that she can have a baby with. We've been taking it slow. Sometimes Sims get turned off by all that. We don't want to, like, chase him away or anything like that. So we've just been flirting with him, getting to know him. Oh, we got to pay the bills, girl. 400 simoleons, that's pretty cheap. We're gonna have to get the mail too. And let's check some recent neighborhood stories. Maybe someone else died. The hecking household adopted a dog. Voting is now closed. Rock your body and mind. Awesome. Okay. We didn't put anything into action yet. Awesome. So we don't have to worry about some of the other goofy ones that have been going on. Bailey Moon household. They're preparing for a baby. Looks like a lot of people are having some babies. Another household moved in in Evergreen Harbor. Cat was adopted by a household in Brindleton Bay. Doesn't look like anyone died. BFF household moved out. Oh, wow. Out of really? Okay, there's people that moved in. Just a lot of moving around, having babies, adoptions. Doesn't seem, oh, someone in the Gandhi household died. He tried fixing the toilet and it randomly burst into flames. No surprise there. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and go to the cemetery. And she's still thinking about Simon. So let's travel to the cemetery, hon. Oh, you want to go read a tome, huh? Well, you can't do that right now. You're going to have to do that when you get back. Besides, I don't even think you can read that tome. And once you look at that, it's raining out. Oh, no. So where can we put him? Let's see. We'll put him in the back for right now. I don't know if I want to. Uh, hmm. I don't think we can. we put his urn over here? There's a couple already, but that's from my build. Let's see if we can put him up there. Ooh, look at that lightning over there. Oh, yep. We can put it over here. But we don't actually have a picture of him. So I think we're going to go ahead and put it over here somewhere. Okay, so... We'll leave him a sugar skull offering and we'll strengthen his connection to the physical world. And it's raining out, girl. So let's hurry up so that you don't get hit by lightning. Oh, man, it's really wet outside, too. It's storming. So we're going to go ahead and take care of that. Oh, good for you, girl. All right. So let's get going. We're going to go back home. We're going to invite over Simon. Where are you going? I'm going to go splash in some puddles. Oh, oh you're going to clean up. The oh, girl, that is a job never done. So let's get going, okay? You can invite over your friend. Oh, girl. I'm so sorry. Oh, it's late, too. I don't know if you're going to be able to cloud gaze with Simon. I mean, the clouds aren't out anymore. The stars and the moon are, but... So, let's see. Uh, maybe we should wait till tomorrow. It's already 9 o'clock at night. And I don't really want you to go to the magic realm right now. So, how about you study a magical tome? Oh, you already got one. See, you're way ahead of me. Well, the tome of Deliriate, I don't even think that you can... Oh, it's... Apprentice? Which one do you have? Perk Purging? Are you even able to read that yet? Yeah, I don't think you are. So how about, where's the Tome of Deliriate? Do you have that in your inventory? Well, where did it go? What'd you do with it, girl? See, you're not even there yet. Ooh, you're almost at Acolyte, and then you can read those tomes. How about you go ahead and practice some more magic? That way you can get up to that. Well, have you practice Untamed Magic? Because we're all about the mischief and the untamed. Are you going to practice in the hallway again? Hopefully you can rank up. Let's find out. Yes, and you discovered a new spell. Zip zap. Oh, you're almost there, girl. Let's try having you practice your magic one more time. I don't know what you could possibly be doing. Oh, you're going to water the flowers? Okay. So let's have you go ahead and practice some more magic. You already did mischief and you already did untamed. Let's try the practical magic. Because, you know, we'd like to be able to clean the house and do certain things with your magic. 
You'll be able to fix things. Maybe I'll get a repario. Ooh, you got, okay. You're an acolyte now, girl. Congratulations. Your prowess in the magical arts is gaining recognition. A magical care package is sent to every acolyte containing some everyday essentials for an up and coming spellcaster. Be sure to check your mailbox. Awesome, girl. I wonder how long it takes for you to get that. Okay, let's just make sure you don't overcharge. Okay, yeah, you're okay. Oh, and you got two more talent points? Oh, good for you. Let's see what we can get with your talent points. Ooh, there's the experimenter. Oh, a moat hound. Okay, well, we definitely have to be able to discharge. Oh, these are all so good. This one's good too. Insightful eye, research, experiment, and tome reading speeds are all greatly increased. Oh, yes. Definitely gotta get those two. Ooh, you're moving up in the world, girl. You're doing really good. And then when you're done, you're gonna have to go to sleep. And it's hot outside. We're gonna have to put up a thermostat for you. I know, unprepared today. Oh, you did the repario too. Good for you. We're gonna have it get cool in the house. So let's see here. You learned two new spells, repario, and you learned zip zap. That is so good, girl. You learned two new spells. Now you can read your tomes. You're gonna go to sleep. Oh, good for you, girl. You slept through the night. And you no longer want to cloud gaze with Simon. But you want to read something because you're a bookworm. And you want to make a new friend. But we're going to have you go ahead and read that tome. Because we've been waiting to be able to do it. And they're in your inventory. So let's go ahead and have you read some. Let's see who study the tomes. And, ooh, okay, awesome. So you're going to have to water some plants. And you're going to have to harvest them. Because we need our money. And it looks like, let's see, are these still in season? Out of season, fall and spring. And what is this, summer? Oh, we're on day three of summer already, girl. So we're going to have to go ahead and buy some plants. Do you have any in your inventory? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and order some flowers. Because you're going to need them. Ooh, magical plants or flowers. I think we're going to get one, two of the flowers, and then we'll get two of the magical plants. Hopefully you'll get something good. There we go. You're going to have to open those as soon as you're done with everything else. So let's see what you have here, girl. We're going to have to see. Oh, you learned Furio. You're moving along here, girl. After all this, you might be able to invite your friend over. He can come over for a visit and we can feel him out a little bit and see how he feels about her. And if it works out, you might be able to have your next generation. So let's see what else is here. Um, we can probably dig this up to see if there's any crystals and we'll check for frogs because we're going to probably end up needing some frogs too. We're working on a relate. Wait, 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 what? We're working on a relationship. So thanks for helping us through it. Oh, that's when he, he had issues with somebody else. Awesome. What are you getting girl? Oh, you finally started. Oh, okay. You got a leaf frog. We're going to sell off some of this stuff because we don't need it. So let's go ahead and invite over your friend. Oh, Morgan got a new job. Good for you. Morgan is a tough guy at Mob Wives. <laughs> what? Oh, you want to become confident? Well, we're going to invite over your friend. Let's see how confident you'll be then. Shigeru. Let's see how he's doing. Maybe he'll come over. You guys can hang out for a little bit. Oh, yes, he's coming over. And there he is. Come on in. We're going to do an impression and, oh, wait, he's flirty, tell an engaging story. Ooh, I think these two really like each other. How's things? Compliment his appearance. And what else can we do here? Discuss interests. And what else can we talk to you about? Do you know what? Let's do a little bit of flirting too. Well, we can't ask him about woohoo interests. How about we do a little flirting? Ooh. Oh, he likes her too. Let's see here. We'll tell a dramatic story. And then, oh, look at that. Look at that. Might be some romance brewing here. Oh, we can confess attraction. Oh, uh, do a knock-knock joke. Maybe he likes jokes. Morgan's calling again. Hey, Lucia, I've been thinking about getting to know Thorn Bailey better as a friend. Do you think the two of us should hang out? Yes. They're getting along so great. He's laughing at our jokes. There's a lot of good, good things going on here. Mm. Oh, do you know what? Let's try holding his hands. Maybe he'll like that too. If he lets her hold his hands, then yeah. Oh, look at that. Oh, first kiss. 
Let's see. Let's see. First kiss. Oh, so cute. Oh. Oh, he's sweet. Oh, and he's got such good traits about him. I think you found your parent to co-parent with. I think he's going to make a good father. So let's go ahead and, oh, what can we do with him? I mean, he's absolutely smitten by her. He really likes her. Ask about hobbies and skills. I mean, they're really sweet on each other. And, ooh, what can we ask him about? Let's see. What can we talk about? And dudes about video games. I mean, he is playing them. Oh, he just likes cooking. Well, that's okay because you're not going to live with us. So we don't have to worry about whether or not you're going to cook. Let's give him a kiss. And then we're going to send him off because we don't want to be too forward with him. We want to actually be able to have a baby with him because he's got a good bloodline in his family. Otherwise, he wouldn't be a sage. So we're going to send him home and we'll have to see him another day. But I want to thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next episode.